What's up, Brizzo here, and this is Fallout 3, very hard difficulty walkthrough, strictly business. Uh, so I'm going after my last target, who is uh, Flack. Now, Flack is um, one of the proprietors of the Flack and Shrapnel store in the River City Marketplace. So warning now, if you enslave Slack, Flack, um, uh, Shrapnel will leave... Rivet City, so if you need guns and stuff, you're going to have to find them some other way. So, uh, lockpick your way into their room, um, I guess they're a couple or something, and I didn't realize it, but they were hiding behind this door, which is, uh, pretty strange. Now, I couldn't find a really good way to get, um, everyone from chasing me. Uh, once you do this to Flack, um, everyone in this area is going to become hostile, so you're going to have to make an epic escape. Uh, and I did, and I'll show you a good way to get out of here. Um, now, the internet says that uh, Rivet City will stop being hostile to you three game, three days in-game time after this incident takes place. Uh, so don't worry about um, never being able to come back here. So, uh, Mez Flack, um, take his shit. Um, put the collar on him, and then you want to get out of here as fast as possible. So what I did was I ran into the stairwell out the front door and jumped into the water to get as far away from here as possible because they will chase you out the front door and they will fire at you. Uh, so just watch my uh, epic escape and head on back to uh, Paradise Falls. Uh, Flack just so happened to be my last target, so uh, depending on what your last target is, uh, you'll get your mission success, and you will get unrestricted access to Paradise Falls. So uh, enjoy. How the hell did you get old Queen Flack into that collar? I'm surprised you're still alive. We need to keep a close eye on that one, though. He knows our system too well. He sold us out to get into Rivet City. We'll never forget that. And now we'll make sure he never forgets it either. Here's another collar. Keep hurting the swine in here and you'll have more bottle caps than you'll know what to do with. Sure thing. 